Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for. I don't even know what the date is. What is the date anyway? The 25th, November 25th, around the 25th. You know, you know, we talked about this. We're not really going to get into it, but the timing is fluid, as we all know. So we're going to go ahead and get started. Dear God, angels, spirits, and universe, what do we have for today? Ooh, justice reversed. Justice reversed. Now this is unfair. Somebody may think that something is unfair, right? They may think it. Um, there's been a lack of truth. Somebody hasn't been telling the truth or they weren't telling the truth. Hmm. Oh, but there's happiness here. Extreme happiness. Somebody's extremely happy. And it's funny because when I was shuffling, I was smiling and I was thinking there's, there's, there's a lot of happiness here. There's a lot of happiness. Something is extremely bright. There's, this is extremely bright. This is a rebirth. Two of Swords. This is the darkness coming to light. You notice this one doesn't have any blindfold on. So something is being shown. The truth has come out after there's been some lies. So the truth is coming out by the looks of things. This person has no fear. No fear at all. Somebody has manifested a new doorway opening. There's a new doorway opening. There's a golden opportunity here. Somebody has manifested. Now this is a solid, stable opening. This person, somebody has a real big opportunity to start over. After there's been an injustice, this person is looking up at an injustice. There's an opportunity to go down a new path. There's a lot of loyalty here. Somebody is going down a new path. They've been given this golden opportunity to start over. Think somebody was treated really unfairly. This We could have a Libra here. There's been somebody that was lying, wasn't telling the truth. Things were unbalanced. But you notice this person or this opportunity is like this, 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 this uh, injustice is being healed. This is healed. So there's an injustice that is being healed. Now this is starting over. They're starting over here. And it's funny because I'm starting over from scratch as well. So starting over. Now this person has no fear even though there's a wolf in the background. It's like, yeah, there's, there's, there's somebody in the background but this person doesn't have any blindfolds on. Put it that way. No fear. So, as long as you keep your eyes open and facing forward, you have nothing to worry about. This is this person has has just needs to remain focused, focused on the prize. Be focused on the prize. Don't keep looking back at the injustice. Focus on the future. This is a big, bright opportunity. So somebody has a big, bright opportunity in front of them. Don't look back. Do not look back. Four of Wands. We have a reunion here. We have a reunion, a celebration. Happiness, a lot of happiness. 
So there's there's some happiness that is coming. This is a happy reunion of some sort. Happy reunion. So yeah, we have a happy reunion of two people that are meant to be together, went, meant to work together, meant to uh, be part of each other's lives. Somebody has manifested a new opportunity that is going to make them very, very, very happy. There could be some, some legal issues, okay, with the justice card. Things happen fast with this Knight of Wands. Very, very, very fast. So fast that you don't even see it. This is something that that is is very quick. Something happens very, very fast. So it's like something charges or something changes. I think it's extremely fast. Extremely fast movement here. It's like so fast that you don't even have time to think. So we have some we have some happy, fast changes that are coming in. And it's going to lead somebody down a new path. And there's opportunity for stability and security and two people to work together very, very closely. This is liberation. This is freedom. So it's the end of a, of a painful situation, right? The Ten of Swords reverse. It's like the suffering is over. It's over. It's time to heal and be happy. It's time for a renewal. We definitely have a renewal here. I'm sure of it. Somebody is right in their glory. They are, or they're going to be. They're going to be right in their glory with this new opportunity that they're given. Somebody may be given a new job or a gift or something that is going to make them extremely happy. And it's like you don't even see it coming. It happens so fast. If somebody has been acting uh, in a state of dishonesty, there's going to be a fast change. The, the justice reversed is somebody that doesn't tell the truth. Hasn't been telling the truth. They've been really unbalanced. They, they couldn't do the right thing. But things change really, really fast. So there's a, there's a rapid change here. Very rapid. And whatever this change is, it's going to bring about a rebirth, a renewal. And it's the end of a painful situation. The tens, this is a completion. It's the very end. This is freedom. This is liberation. The choice. This is the choice. The choice is made. The decision is made. There's no blindfolds on here. It's clear. It's very clear. So clearly a decision is being made or a choice is being made. And, in, and the two of swords can be sudden as well. So interesting. Somebody was blocking their emotions, blocking the truth. And they, the whoever, somebody is experiencing a loss of some sort, or they have experienced a loss, a loss of stability, a loss of security, a loss of abundance. Somebody could be losing something uh, very significant with this Ace of Pentacles. Somebody could be losing money or losing a job. And that may be what gives them an opportunity to go down a new path. You know, sometimes you have to, well, you do, you have to, things have to end so that you can start over. So somebody is losing something that they were holding on to, for sure. There's no stability there. There's no security, nothing long term. Somebody didn't plan Somebody didn't plan effectively, and now there's a loss. This is blocking growth. Somebody was blocking either their own growth or another person's growth. But there is, there is some sort of happiness with this Four of Wands and the Sun card. Extreme happiness is coming because there is a new doorway opening that you may not see. It could happen 
very suddenly, very fast. You may be, you may feel like, um, this isn't, that, that, that this loss is too much. You may feel like this is killing you, but there's a reason. So there is a loss that really hurt that is being replaced with another opportunity. There's a new foundation that is being built with this Four of Wands. And it's quite, un I know that it's unexpected. There could be somebody that is, is there's like a, a commitment that is stepping it up to the next level. Somebody could even be getting proposed to or a ring or something like that. Okay, this is a gift. Somebody's getting a gift. This That's a messenger of something solid, something stable, a new opportunity that can grow if you remain focused. Now we have this King of Cups reversed. <laughs> okay, so we have somebody here that is unemotional, unemotional, um, withdrawn, doesn't know how to love, or is it open to love? This person um, may use emotional blackmail as a tactic. Not very mature. Somebody that may see themselves as a victim. I'm going to put it right here. I feel like we have somebody here that may see themselves as a victim and they don't realize. They don't realize that... You know, I feel like this card is supposed to be over here, so I have to put it over here. That's, I mean, I'm not into it. It is. It's, it's supposed to be over here. Because this person is emotionally unavailable and they're experiencing a loss. This person sees themselves as a victim. This person has a victim mentality. We have somebody here that doesn't know what love is or doesn't know how to love or is emotionally unavailable and they are experiencing a loss. Very secretive and closed off. We have some, you know, that's what we got here. We have somebody that has to make a choice, has to make a decision as well. Could be this person. It could be. This person may have to make a decision whether, whether, you know, huh, what they want to do here. So, could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio that could be vindictive. He absolutely could be. He could be vindictive. Be careful for that wolf behind your back. There is, there is somebody here that is very sneaky. Very, very sneaky. And I feel like this sneaky person is gonna, is, uh, you know, there's, there is, this is, there is very sneaky. Stuck. We have somebody here that is stuck, trapped in their own thoughts. Could be dealing with a Taurus. Mental conflict. There we have prison here. This is prison, trapped in their own prison. So, this is freedom from prison. So somebody is being freed from a, some sort of confinement, some sort of prison. This is freedom. Somebody is being freed from some sort of confinement. But that freedom is going to be a loss for somebody else. This person hasn't been seeing the truth. They've been staying in that situation because they just didn't know any better or they felt comfortable there. There could be some... There could be like a love-hate relationship here. Just saying. Somebody is holding on. Holding on to a foundation, trying to hold on to an old foundation out of, out of their own misery, out of their own greed, out of their own stubbornness. 
not willing to share, not willing to open up, not willing to give, wanting to have it all to themselves. This person isn't seeing a situation clearly. They, they just can't think clearly. We have somebody here that cannot think clearly. They just don't act out of a heart space. They act out of greed. So we have somebody here that acts out of greed. This person that acts out of greed is going to experience a loss. And it could be a job. It could be a business. Because this Ace of Pentacles, that's a big, huge loss. So somebody could experience a big, huge loss by engaging with some sort of injustice. I feel like you need to be, somebody needs to be really careful because there's somebody, this is a wolf. You know, you gotta be, you gotta be careful. You may, you may not realize what you are getting yourself engaged in. So somebody may be thinking about getting themselves engaged in something out of spite. But it's probably not a very good decision. Somebody could end up in prison. They could end up in prison. You know, when the secrets come out, they could end up in prison. Somebody could end up in prison. It could be this King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. It doesn't have to be. Somebody, I mean, this is prison. Trying to hide something. If somebody may be trying to hide something, you know, and the truth, because this is like, there's no blindfold on here. This is seeing the truth. Somebody could tell the truth or see the truth. I don't know. Somebody could end up in prison. Anyhow. So, I think that there is a happy reunion here for somebody, or there's a happy new beginning. There is a happy new beginning that is starting after there has been an injustice. Things happen very, very fast. There's like a sudden change here. Somebody is experiencing a loss, or they will be experiencing a big loss because of their inability to see the truth or something like that, or because of their spite, because of their hate, because of their inability to uh, act out of a heart space. Somebody could, this person that doesn't act with their heart could experience a big loss. They have a decision to make whether they want to go this way or that way. Prison is involved here. Somebody may be hiding something or trying to hide something. There's an opportunity to, uh, this is liberation, break free from this confinement, break free from this situation, and just be happy and go your merry own little way. So somebody has an opportunity here that is being given to them. It's a golden opportunity that can lead to stability and security. But this is a choice. You can choose to go down the path to stability and security. Or you can choose to uh, end up someplace you don't want to be. So we have a choice here. This is right around the corner. This is a choice. Somebody is going to have to make a painful, stressful decision. Or at least it's stressful. A stressful decision. Do you want to experience a loss? Or do you want to experience growth? The choice is yours. So be prepared to make a choice in the next few days. You're going to have to think fast. You're going to have to act fast. You, there will, I mean, this is karma. This is bad karma. The very first card that came out. There is bad karma for the decisions that you make. Or good. Bad or good. There's an opportunity for happiness and growth and for you to go your own way. Or you can choose, you can choose to react in the wrong way and experience a huge loss. Choose your actions wisely in the next few days. Karma is watching. Good luck. And I see somebody going to prison. Talk to you later.